tackles for loss this year. Officially, that was a gain of one. Now here's a throw inside, and it's a welcome back for Harrison Wallace. Trey Wallace, who caught the ball, but then at the very end, it's important that these guys played to a high standard. They wanted to do that all year long. Starting with the bowl game last year. Punt return. Oh! Moves by Daquan Hardy. Daquan Hardy's still going. Daquan Hardy's got a convoy and going all the way to the end zone. Touchdown on the punt return. 55 yards. Motion out of the backfield by Lynch Adams. Pumachon has the most time he's had to throw today and finds George Johnson the third. He does and does something with it. Allen still going. The pile is pushed past the 45 to the 47 yard line. A run of 18 yards. Second down and short, and Allen's got a good pocket, and the pass is caught by Wallace, and he broke one tackle and almost another one. It's a first down, so close to a touchdown pass for Wallace. Third tight end, Khalil Dinkins is out today. Andrew Rapelier is in the game as the third tight end, and they push Drew Aller forward on the quarterback sneak. We've seen this run many, many times by Penn State, and in this case, it leads to Drew Aller's third rushing touchdown of the season. More Catron Allen. There's been a lot of him on this drive, and he finishes it off with a stretch for the end zone and a touchdown. Twelve catches this year for Theo Johnson coming into play today. Third and goal. And that one's on the money. Tyler Warren, touchdown. A lot of time to throw, a lot of room for a throw and a catch and a touchdown for Theo Johnson. Three hundred pounder from Burtonsville, Maryland. Devon Ellis with that play. Nice punt by Kolochi. Caden Saunders seems to return. Broke two tackles. The punter Kologi, or no, I'm sorry, that was the deep snapper, Ethan Dumont, who slowed him down. James Franklin wants to get those explosives going. Here's a chance for Theo Johnson in the flat. Up he goes, and in he goes. Stuck the landing. Touchdown, Penn State. Punt by C.J. Kologi. That is a line drive, and... Daquan Hardy can do something special again. He's got one punt return for a touchdown. If he can beat the punter and make it to the end zone, he's got two. But even as you get in your second and third unit, they're not out of position. Ran the clock down. Oh, hasted hit as he throws, and it's intercepted, and it's a run back, and it's going to be a pick six for Keaton Ellis. Okay. Trey Potts is in the game, and the transfer from Minnesota untouched into the end zone, and the lead is 55 to nothing. Potts, who had two touchdowns in the last game, scores early in the fourth quarter of this one. See this play here. Big hole for Tank Smith. This is a real opportunity here for Tank Smith. And Smith is forced out of bounds by Michael Opong. Redshirt senior, 102 career rushing yards. He just picked up 39 on the last run. And then Perbula will take it all the way into the end zone to finish off the drive. I think their eyes are on, and their mind is set on a team goal of a conference title and competing for a national title. Saw so the show of respect between James Franklin and Don Brown. Penn State has won 11 consecutive games by 14 plus points.